Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Ava. I make videos about beauty, fashion, and life. Today I have a little haul. It's a little Skims unboxing. If in the small chance you're like me and have never tried Skims or have never heard of it even, it is a brand by Kim Kardashian. I know, she's a little controversial right now. But we're just talking when about When Skims first came out, I had no intention of trying it, buying it. I was like, oh, it's shapewear, whatever, right? I ordered a few things because basically I wanted to try it out for myself. First, I thought it was just shapewear. I'm like, eh, I have shapewear, whatever. There's so many shapewear brands. And then I kept seeing skims, skims, skims everywhere, right? It's like they came out with all these different types, like fits everybody cotton, indoor, outdoor, in the bed, in the swimming pool now <laughs> with Kim Swim. It's like, they're obviously not going anywhere anytime soon. So I decided I will finally jump on the Skims bandwagon. I got a few things. <sighs> like always, I haven't opened it up yet, so I don't know. We're gonna see if this is worth the hype if it's what everybody says it is or what you know because I've seen so many influencers do these type of videos and I'm never sure if like you know they just got sent some free stuff so they're hyped about it or what so I'm gonna see for myself and I'm gonna tell you what I truly think because I bought this stuff with my own money <laughs> Skims, if you're listening feel free to send me some more stuff if you want me to try it Skims is pricey. She ain't playing. This is a cute, you know, branded little package it came in. It looks like everything is wrapped individually. Okay, so probably the first thing that the Skims line came out with were undergarments. I guess a lot of the pieces sell out fast and they have certain colors that everybody wants. So a lot of the colors that I saw were in fact sold out but they do periodic restocks the first thing i got is this triangle bralette in the color clay it is buttery soft just like everybody says this one has adjustable straps still has the tag on it so you see i haven't tried it yet but I am going to try it on and let you know like what I think of it. As far as undergarments to go with this, I got two different options to wear with this color. I got the full brief. And one thing that I saw on the different commercials is that it's just really stretchy. I got size large, I believe. Yes, I've got size large large and this is supposed to be just like really stretchy and comfortable I got the full-size brief as well as the boy short sometimes with different boy shorts what I don't like is if they're tight around the leg oh this is nice and stretchy too so if you got the thick thighs you know you or juicy as my girl Tia says these seem like they'll be good so I'm gonna let you know I got those and then in the color sand I got the fits everybody cheeky brief so these are the briefs so I can try these on and describe how they fit I'm not gonna show you but as far as the things I can and will show you I got the fits everybody long sleeve tee in the co color sand and now I'm kicking myself for getting the long sleeve because here I thought oh you know it's about to be spring we're still gonna have some cold days and it's been like 80 degrees and warmer so I kind of wish I got the short sleeve I don't know if the short sleeve was in stock but I'm still gonna try it on and I just thought this would be a nice neutral color to go with a lot of different things to wear under a blazer or you know style it different ways or just wear it in the house <laughs> I don't know if 
if this is something you would wear out because it does seem a little see-through, but I think it's intended to wear out. Is it? Hmm, I don't know. In any case, it is very soft, like just as soft as everybody says. I also got this cotton ribbed tank. It's black, but they call the color soot. So I got this in a large. I'm thinking I should have got it in extra large. This is definitely something I just got to lounge around in. So I got the tank and the boxer short. And you can see, I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, but it has like the little skims tag right here. And then it also has a tag like that at the on the back of the tank. There's a little skims logo there. Okay, so let me get to trying these. And I'll come back with my thoughts and opinions. This is the cotton rib tank in the color soot. I like I said, I got a large. I probably should have gotten an extra large, however. I am plan planning to lose weight. I'm gonna be joining Tia's 21 day challenge intentionally. Tia has all the details on her channel. I'm gonna link that below if you want to join us starting April 1st or even after if you're um, watching it after this, just still watch it and get some good tips. But, okay so, the tank is very soft. I mean, this the rib cotton is super soft. It feels very comfortable. I got an extra large in the boxers, which is good. So I would say thumbs up for the tank and the boxers. Now, I have on the bralette and so obviously, well not obviously, but it is a bralette and so there's no snap closure or anything. It's like a pull on over the head. But I do like the fact that it has um, adjustable straps. So, and you, I don't know if you can see, but the strap is actually a little cushiony. So it's really comfortable. So I like the fact that you can adjust it to, um, you know, account for if the girls need to be lifted or what have you, whatever your size are, if you have a longer um, torso or whatever the case may be. So I like that, that's a thumbs up for me. The fabric is really soft and on the bralette it's kind of like doubled. So it's not as thin as the t-shirt material or the underwear. <laughs> Okay. Okay, so let's get to the underwear. I have only tried one style so far and that's the boy short. Now, the leg, yes, while it was stretchy in order to accommodate us larger girls, it's rolling up. So it's like, it's rolling, it's not, you know, like we're a boy short. I'm gonna lower the camera. Okay, so these are the boxers. Comfy, nice loungewear for home, but you could see the indentation from the boy short rolling up. That is not cute, okay? And it's not comfortable either. It's like, it cuts you where um, it should be like laying flat, if that makes sense. Like, if, if, if it were laying flat, let me show you what it would look like, sorry. Okay. So if it were laying flat, like you would still be able to see a line, and I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, but it wouldn't like, cut at that you know meaty part it's just like not flattering so 
thumbs down for the boy short. Also, about the boy short, it's so thin. Like, I got the color sand, like I said, and I have a tattoo back here, so it's going to allow you to see how thin it is. Like, you can see my tattoo right through the material. So, yeah. Sorry, Mom, but it's important research, right? So, I'm going to say thumbs down on the boy short. And, um, like I said, I haven't tried the other ones yet. I'm going to see if I can try on the long sleeve shirt and um, if it's, like, decent enough to show you guys. Okay, and we're back. So, thoughts. For one, this is so warm. I wish that I had ordered it in the winter when... You need to layer because that's really what this is going to be good for is if you need it to be layered. Now I wouldn't wear a shirt like this as a big girl because as you can see it just like it works its way up and like rolls up like it doesn't when you start moving around and stuff it doesn't stay down. So you either need the bodysuit or you're going to have to tuck it in in order for it to be like comfortable and not moving. It is really soft so if you're someone who is like stimulated by touch, go ahead and order some of the Fits Everybody collection because it's very soft for sure. So I change out of the boy shorts and put on the cheeky briefs. They're super comfortable and they don't have you know any of those lines like the uh, boy short did. So the other thing about the long sleeve is that it is a little bunchy. It's okay if you're just going to be layering it but I don't know. I mean this stuff is expensive. Is it worth the hype? Not so sure. I would say for the boy shorts, definitely not. The cheeky briefs are very comfortable. Still a thin material. You can still see my tattoo through it. The t-shirt is really annoying because it rolls up. You know, and like, if you have a little back fat, you're like, is that my back fat or is that the shirt? That's not the business, okay? I definitely recommend the tank and the boxers. And they also have a new a newer line. That's the boyfriend line. I, boyfriend line is not ribbed and it has like looser tees and tanks and looser boxers. So just an FYI, if you're in the market for some skins, is it 100% worth the hype? My vote is no. But that's just my first impression. Would I be open to trying more skins? Yes. Let me know what your thoughts are. Do you have any skins? Are you in the market for some? Are you going to try some? Like I said, um, they have so many different pieces. and Some of it might be worth a try. And remember, you're never too young or too old to unleash your beauty and explore your style.